Tonight on Caveman News, the people of Mariupol are evacuated. Gas prices in Arkansas continue to rise. This week's weather, sunny with some showers and some cold spots. And the Razorbacks are in the top 15 teams in the country. My name is Sean. And I'm Steve. All this and more detail here on Caveman News. In our first story tonight, a small number of people have left Mariupol. According to the BBC, people are leaving a small part of Mariupol who have left the major... People are leaving a small part of Mariupol who have left the major port when ceasefire broke down Saturday and Sunday. They have been circled by Russians, left without power, and are running out of food. But thankfully, the people are making it out. Local journalist Anna Romanko told BBC a column of private cars managed to leave the city. One of those fled on a rural road in the dark and managed to make it back to Ukraine-controlled territories. We wish Ukraine the best of luck with the arrest of the evacuation. According to an article by KAIT Region 8 News, as flooding ramps up between Russia and Ukraine, the gas prices in Arkansas have jumped up 50 cents in price. Analysts are warning that massive spikes in prices will only worsen over time. The average gasoline price in Arkansas has risen 48.4 cents a gallon in the past week to $3.69. That's $1.12 higher than last year and 59 cents more than what a motorist would have paid a month ago. Patrick DeHaan has said the prices in California could be headed towards $5.50, with stations in the state chain charging more than, more than $6. The forecast for Cave City and the surrounding area calls for partly sunny skies today with a couple of showers possible. That chance of showers is 30% and it will be around 67 degrees with the high. Tonight you can expect cool temperatures with clear skies and a low of 39 degrees. Tomorrow, warm sunny skies and a high of 65. Tomorrow night should be clear and cooler with just another low of 40 degrees. The weather for Wednesday, March 16th, calls for warm sunshine and a high of 73 degrees and the winds will be out of the south at 9 miles an hour. Wednesday night should be clear and cool down with another low of 45 degrees. The Arkansas Razorbacks enter postseason play in the top 15 teams in the country, according to an article written by Whole Hog Sports. Last week, Arkansas split games between LSU and Tennessee. In a close game against the Tigers, Arkansas took the victory, beating them 77-76. to And the Razorbacks, though, were defeated by the Vols with a score of 78-74. to Eric Musselman, had, the head coach for the Razorbacks, said that he was really satisfied with how the team played in the second half of the season. The Razorbacks ended the season with a finalized score of 14 wins in its final 16 games. That concludes Caveman News. I'm Sean. And I'm Stevie. Thank you for tuning in and have a good day.